I can't form sentences. <laughs> Hello and welcome. In this video, we are talking about a podcast. Um, I've started a trend here where every other podcast video is either about a discussion podcast or an audio drama. So this time we're discussing a discussion podcast and that show is Somewhere in the Skies. Somewhere in the Skies is a show dedicated to discussing current UFO events, the paranormal, and the just plain weird. It features episodes about current events in U the UFO field from across the world. It features special guests and audio documentaries, not to mention the bonus episodes that are just Ryan talking with his friends about cool movies and things that kind of fit into the genre. So. Let's get started. Let's talk about what I like about the podcast. <laughs> okay, so what I really love the most are the episodes that are witness accounts. So you see, Ryan is a great speaker and a great interviewer, but that's not what I love the most. I love that he lets the experiencers speak for themselves. He lets their experiences speak for themselves. He doesn't try to prove whether or not a person's telling the truth. He simply lets them talk and he really focuses on their feelings and how those stories, how those events affected their lives. In fact, that's what his entire book is about, is sharing those stories from people that were kind enough to open up to him and share them and let him write them down and really dive into the effects that experiencing something UFO related can have on your life. It's huge. The witness account stories are just about that, telling the stories as is. And I think the reason, and um, I'm sure he's probably stated this before, but the reason why he tell, he lets people tell stories like that and the reason why he focuses on giving them a platform for that is because he has his own story. And you can read Ryan's um, UFO story in his book or you can listen to him tell it himself on the podcast. So if the Witness Account episodes are my absolute favorite, then the runner-up by and far are the audio documentaries. Ryan is so good at telling these stories. I can zone into them for hours whenever I'm behind. So of all the audio docs that are available to listen to in his podcast feed, my absolute favorite is the two-part series on James Forrestal. This is the story of a Secretary of Defense and his possible connections with MJ-12 and his questionable death in 1949. It's a beautiful commentary on not just UFO conspiracies, but history too. And then next up, we'll talk about the interview episodes where he has special guests. Sometimes they're not interviews. Sometimes they're just discussions where he lets the guests, you know, talk about their interest in the field or whatever it is they bring to the table. But they're not always UFO guests, hence... Um, the description of the paranormal and the just plain weird. He also has guests from those fields too. I think it's pretty easy to say if you were able to listen to the entire podcast feed, you would end up being quite an expert in the field yourself because there's so much information that is conveyed, so many um, aspects and details in all of the sides. I, I know there are a lot of people out there that are really into weird stuff and the paranormal, but aliens is like that thing that they can't really touch. It's a little bit too weird for them. And honestly, I think that this show is the show for all types of people, especially those people um, who would like to kind of incorporate that into their listening, but aren't quite really... <laughs> we got a giddy. Um... 
aren't quite really able to find one that just turn that doesn't turn them off. Um, and this show is that because I think, like I've said about many shows like this before, is I like the ones that aren't trying to persuade you to believe. Um, yeah, Ryan believes, but it's okay if you don't, if you listen to him, um, and you're not going to feel like his, his goal is to persuade you. His goal is to inform you. The, the show is rational and intelligent and really darn entertaining. So thank you everybody for watching. Thank you patrons. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you'd like to see more of these videos and leave me a message in the comments below about what you think about my videos, what you think about this podcast. And and I don't think we can talk about Somewhere in the Skies without at least attempting to do the outro. Remember, keep your feet on the ground and never stop searching somewhere in the skies.